everyone and welcome back to another video and as you can see in the background I bought a 50cc scooter so this is my 2011 Honda today and I think it was a good in between between a motorcycle and an e-bike it's quite good on gas it's a four-stroke so it's uh, a bit more economic and environmentally friendly than a two-stroke yeah I think it's just a really cute little scooter um, I'll put some clips showing you around um, but basically my goals for this little scoot here is to just make it go a little faster currently top speed is about capped at 50 so that's probably gonna involve de-restricting that's probably also gonna involve maybe like a needle and a new pulley and stuff um, I have owned a scooter before so this isn't the first time um, but also I just want to do like general maintenance stuff I also want to get like things like a phone mount and just general accessories like that um, but yeah, I'm really excited to show you guys more of my little Honda today. So as you can see, it's a pretty basic scooter. It doesn't even have like a fuel gauge. That's how basic it is. But otherwise, it's a pretty nice styled scooter. Um, obviously inspired by a lot of Italian scooters, but let's go ahead and ride it! Alright, um, let's talk specs, we haven't done this before. Um, so obviously it's a 50cc um, single cylinder engine that makes a whopping 3.8 PS or 2.8 kilowatts if you're in New Zealand. The uh, Scooter weighs about 79 kilos, which is actually pretty heavy, um, surprisingly. But obviously it's a four stroke, so you don't have to mix oil in. And it has tiny, tiny 10 inch tires. The engine's actually kind of cool, so it's obviously single cylinder four stroke, but it's actually got forced air cooling, so it has like a little fan on the side as you might have seen. Um, and it's also an overhead cam, surprisingly. I thought it would be push rod, but no, it's overhead cam. Um, it is obviously carbureted, but carbureted is generally better for motorcycles anyway. It actually is snowing, so I'm going to be traveling up a mountain on this scooter. And yeah, I actually made it up. As you can see, it's super snowy. Um, the roads were quite slippery and icy. Obviously, 10 inch tires aren't exactly the most stable thing in the world. But yeah, as you can see, we barely made it. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.